Welcome, in front of me is a Redmi Note 12 Pro and today I will show you how we can record a screen on this phone. So, to get started, pull down your notifications by swiping down on your home screen and then locate the toggle which could be on the second page which you can access by swiping to the left. And as you can see that that's where the toggle is for me, so this one right over here, screen and recorder. Once you find it, you can either tap on it to immediately start a recording or you can also hold it and this will take you to the settings where you can just check out how it's set by default. Now by default, uh, from what I've seen, it's set well, pretty good for what this phone can record at. Uh, so the only thing that I'll recommend changing right here is the frame rate 24, contrary to what mm, some people might say, 24 is not cinematic, it's garbage. Unfortunately, we don't have very many frame rate options right here, so we are capped at 30. So that is the highest we can go, and that is also what I would recommend selecting the highest here. Other than that, everything else is set pretty good. Video quality uh, at 30 frames should be good, uh, so 16 megabits. If you find it that it's kind of becoming pixelated, uh, maybe blurry in like motion, you can increase it, but just by one more uh, or higher one, so 24 anything above that will just be a significant overkill. Uh, then resolution also set to the highest, so I recommend keeping it also at that. So there we go. Uh, now we can close this and let's find the toggle once more. I can tap on it. It will bring... The absolute F was that. Uh, so yeah, I'm just gonna mute everything. There we go. So once you press on the button, it will bring up this overlay. And from here, you have a couple options. Record folder, which will take you to, uh, to the all, well, all screen recordings that have captured over the time. Uh, settings, which you have access by holding the toggle and also close. So I just start recording. I'm just kind of fiddling around so there's something to view. Once you're done, interact with the overlay. Click on the square to stop it and now we can find our recording in the gallery application. It will be visible right at the top or by going into the albums, screenshots and screen recordings and simply select screen recordings and you can see it right over here. So there we go. Now, if you found this very helpful, don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and thanks for watching.